Planet Dolan. From on-air suicides to moments that would change the course of history, we look at 10 shocking moments in live TV. Number 10. Tommy Cooper's death. Talk about a comedy act just dying on stage. The audience got a little bit more than they bargained for. Iconic British Welsh comedian Tommy Cooper was performing on a live TV show called Live from Her Majesty's where he suffered a fatal heart attack on stage. The audience, however, thought it was all part of the act and continued to laugh as he fell down on stage. Finally, a commercial break was called and Cooper was dragged backstage where an EMT tried to revive him. However, for some reason, the show still went on, forcing the paramedics to work in the dark backstage. Number 9. The murder of Allison Parker and Adam Ward. This is one of those rare TV moments where the crew filming are the ones involved in the shocking event. During a live interview, we suddenly hear gunshots and screams as a cameraman falls to the ground capturing the killer for a brief second. The feed cuts back to the studio to a news anchor who's just as shocked as we are. Turns out the murderer was a former employee at the station. Vester Flanagan murdered the pair after he was laid off and even filmed the whole thing from his perspective, which he uploaded to the internet before killing himself. Number 8. Manila Bus Siege The broadcast that made millions never want to ride on a Greyhound coach ever again. Former Filipino police officer Rolando Mendoza took a tourist bus of 25 people hostage, demanding that he get a fair hearing over his recent dismissal. The 10-hour siege was broadcast live and showed the Manila SWAT team storming the bus with lots of gunfire involved. Eight people were killed, including Mendoza, in a gun battle that lasted 90 minutes in total. Screw taking a bus, I'll just take a plane. Safe, hijack-free airplanes. Number 7. Waco Siege A bloody, brutal gunfight that was one of the most infamous moments of the 90s all caught on live TV. A 51-day siege of the Waco compound owned by the Branch Davidians cult finally came to an end in a hail of tear gas, bullets, and a blazing fire that would eventually engulf the entire place. Viewers looked on as the FBI stormed the buildings and the flames rose, eventually killing 76, including the cult leader David Koresh. The whole event would also be a primary inspiration for Timothy McVeigh's Oklahoma City bombing. Number 6. The Assassination of Anijiro Asanuma Well, this would certainly spice up those boring political debates about tax rates stabbing a candidate to death with a katana. In 1960, the leader of the Japanese Socialist Party, Anijiro Asanuma, was participating in a debate for the upcoming election, when 17-year-old Atoye Yamaguchi rushed the stage and impaled him on a Yarui Doshi sword, killing him almost instantly. Yamaguchi was a militant nationalist, arrested immediately after and eventually killed himself in prison. The assassination was broadcast repeatedly after the incident and the Socialist Party dissolved shortly after, so I guess violence does get you what you want. Number 5. Christine Chubbuck's Suicide a live on-air anchor committing suicide? I suppose it's no more grotesque than half the stories they cover. Christine Chubbuck had a distinguished career in news media that came to a shocking end when during a live broadcast she turned to the camera and said, In keeping with Channel 40's policy of bringing you the latest in blood and guts and in living color, you're about to see another first. Attempted suicide! She then pulled out a revolver and shot herself in the head. All tapes of the incident are said to have been destroyed, and the shocking event in part provided inspiration for the Oscar-winning film network. I don't think her goal is to win some douchebag a shiny statue, but at least somebody got something out of it. Number 4. Challenger Oh, sweet little innocent Billy, so you want to be an astronaut, huh? Let me show you something that'll scare you from ever wanting to go to space. With the space race picking up its second wind in the 1980s, shuttle launches were pretty routine. So when the Challenger exploded only minutes after launch, viewers were left with gaping mouths over what just happened. Even more tragically, one of the crew members, T-Drex, had won a competition to go into space. But you said you wanted to be an astronaut, Billy. There's no turning back now. Wipe those tears away, little Billy. It's time to get in the rocket. Make your daddy proud. Number 3. The LA Riots Total anarchy gripping a major city during one of the most politically charged times in U.S. history makes it look like society's crumbling in front of our eyes. After the controversial acquittal of the police officers involved in the Rodney King beating, people took to the streets to express their anger, turning South Central L.A. into a war zone. Drivers being pulled from cars and beaten, buildings set on fire, and helicopters being shot at are just some of what was captured by news crews. The shocking spectacle kept viewers glued to their TV for days. Not quite as good as watching a live stream on the ground, but not too too bad. Number 2. The Assassination of Lee Harvey Oswald 
Some might call it karmic retribution and others call it part of a cover-up. After assassinating President John F. Kennedy, the assassin Lee Harvey Oswald got a taste of his own medicine. He was shot at point-blank range by Jack Ruby as he's being transported out of the prison. Television crews were there to capture every disturbing second. Well, I say disturbing, but there were some people yelling in joy that Oswald had been shot. The moment would become as iconic as JFK's death and then be dissected by conspiracy theorists for years to come. Number 1 the impact of United Airlines Flight 175. One of the darkest and most shocking days in modern history all unfolding on live television. After all news channels began to cover what was thought to be an accidental collision of an aircraft with the World Trade Center, viewers watched in horror as a second plane hit the towers. Turning from a horrific accident to a terrifying attack in a matter of seconds was a moment that shocked people to the core. Confusion, terror, and raw tragedy summarized in one shocking moment for millions around the world to see. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Did you enjoy the video? That's fantastic! Did you know we still have a gaming channel? Collaborative is for playing it all and come look at us as we play some video games! Like animation? Have some questions about life and the universe you need answered? Come check out Super Planet Dolan. Danger Dolan and I will answer your life questions. Links are down below.